Hi everyone, welcome to Becky's Crafts and Goodies. Today we're going to make up some of the hot chocolate drinking cones that are great to give in Christmas Eve boxes, stocking fillers, they're great for work colleagues, they're quite cheap, so they're great um, a little idea to do. Now we're going to start by using these cello cones. Now I bought these from Amazon, I'm going to leave the link for these in the description down below. And for each cone I use two of these little bags and I'll show you why in a second. I'm going to use this drinking chocolate, now I'm using this one because this is actually dairy free if you add your own soya milk. So um, some of the others you can, um, some of the others have got milk in, so that's why I don't use the ones personally that you just add water to. But use whichever one you find um, that's suitable for you. So with this particular pot, I need three spoons of, well, heat, three heaped teaspoons of the hot drinking chocolate. And this is why we use two bags. So what we do now is we tie off, let me just grab that ribbon, we tie off the bag with some curling ribbon. And what this does is it stops the hot chocolate getting all mixed in with the marshmallows. So I think that looks quite messy and I don't sort of like that look, especially if you're making them, you know, a few weeks before. So just get a bit of curling ribbon, tie it off at the top there, and then just snip off the extra bits of ribbon and snip down as far as you can get without um, snipping too much off. And then you get the second cone and then you pop that little bag inside there. So you can't see that you've got two bags but it's in a nice little container. Then I'm going to add the marshmallows and sometimes you have to just poke them down a little bit so they hide the... Um, the sort of area that you've you've made up and once you've done that just scrunch it at the top and then we're going to add some more curling ribbon just to hold it tight now I have also seen people do reindeer ones of these I've been to a few craft fairs where they've got those you can um, put like little antlers on the top some googly eyes um, and maybe a little pom-pom for a nose down the bottom and that would be really good and all you do then is you just curl it up and that is them done. You can also buy stickers like eBay sell lots of um, like personalised stickers and stuff. You can get some that say hot chocolate on them um, but literally that is it. That is all you need to do. Now I've made a couple more here and I've also made one without putting the extra bag in and if you can see that the drinking chocolate does get mixed in there so I always do this option because it looks so much better I think so it's a nice little tip for you there. Now if your kids don't drink drinking chocolate or hot chocolate um, you can use milkshake so I thought milkshake would be another little op option or alternative because not every children um, you know like that sort of thing so what we're going to do is we'll do the same thing I won't put the marshmallows in but they obviously like you can get different kinds of milkshake too you can get like, banana flavoured strawberry flavours so it doesn't have to actually be chocolate. So I've got the chocolate one, but you don't, you know, you don't have to use that. And all we're going to do is do it in exactly the same way. And this one, you, th you put three teaspoons in. This is the Nest Quick. And what I would recommend doing is just doing a little label saying that it's milkshake. Um, do a little tag and um, just pop that on the side. And that, you know, would be absolutely fine. So you just get your, your ribbon and just do it in exactly the same way. But it's a shame for kids to miss out if they don't like hot chocolate. But as I say, lots of kids like milkshakes. So all they'll have to do is to put this into whatever milk they prefer. And then that's it. And you could, this would look quite cute, made as um, a reindeer because it's all brown on the bottom. So I think that would be cute to put like a little nose on. Um, or you could use some of um, some different ribbon as well if you wanted to make it a bit fancier. And if you felt this top part was too long, just cut a bit off. It's absolutely fine. So there's a little milkshake pod there um, that you could use. If you don't want to make these up yourself, then if you go into supermarkets, you can buy these kind of one-shot packets. You can get things like Horlicks, there's the Maltesers hot chocolate. You can get the instant hot chocolate where you just add the hot water and there's a galaxy one as well. So if you didn't want to make these up yourself, then you could also cheat and buy them already done. I think I paid 
um, four for a pound for these in Asda. I think that's what they were. So they're great. We're going to do another video now and I'm going to be using these items in that. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you're all okay and I will see you again soon. You take care. Bye for now.